have you two worked together? Because obviously you've yeah. been on the conversation a bit, haven't we? Yeah, we did. I did early Buzzcocks yes. with you, which was fun. Oh. And we've done lots of comedy. We did a you show were in the Bake Off tent as well. Bake Off. We did a show with Jimmy Carr, didn't we? Yes. And I think I described us as, you know those uh, sex cards you get in phone boxes? Yeah. Well, <laughs> <laughs> I described us as Gaffrin is the... Uh, it's the girl on, on the sex card, and I'm what actually turns up. <laughs> <laughs> Beauty and the Beast. But you know what? Um, you were... Now, in the Bake Off tent, I know you've come up with quite an old theory mm. about the Bake Off tent. Right. So they don't show the bees. And bees, of course, love sugar and sweet things, and the Bake Off tent is so beautiful and iconic and outdoors. But I felt like it was an added layer of pressure <laughs> to make the bakers mess up because there's always a threat of bees. Yeah. <laughs> right? I mean, and you went to the next level where you, you accused them of actually deliberately releasing bees into the tent <laughs> to undermine your efforts. Well, that's the only reason why my cherry pie could have ended up so soggy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You, what are you saying, that we train bees to come in and fuck with you all? <laughs> you don't have to train them, it's their innate nature. Have you, let me ask you that's this. That's the genius of it's it. It's Prue that does it. But, uh, but <laughs> I'm more of a spider guy, look at me. <laughs> Seriously though, do they release bees? We do. <laughs> <laughs> we put scorpions in the cutlery drawer. <laughs> 